भारत आज भी आंतरिक से सारे जहाँ से अच्छा दिखता है भारत आज भी सारे जहाँ से अच्छा लगता है These were the words of group captain Shubhanshu Shukla after returning to India from the International Space Station. In a press conference with the ISRO chief Dr. V Narayanan, Union Minister Dr. Jitendra Singh and group captain Prashant V Nair, who is a part of the Gaganyaan crew. At the press conference, group captain Shubhanshu Shukla, the mission pilot in the recent Axiom 4 space flight provided in-depth insights into the mission and its importance for India's human space flight goals. highlighting the critical knowledge acquired through direct experience in space apart from that the isro chief dr veena rainan recounted india's achievements in space throughout the recent years isro chief veena rainan announced that the first gaganyaan test mission will launch in december this mission is part of gaganyaan 2025 india's first planned human space flight mission Apart from this he stated that the GSLV F16 rocket successfully placed the prestigious NASA ISRO synthetic aperture radar that is NISAR satellite on July 30th This satellite which is a joint venture between NASA's Jet Propulsion Laboratory that is JPL and ISRO is functioning perfectly In the next 2 to 3 months ISRO will launch a 6500 kg communication satellite for the USA using one of their launch vehicles To this, he extended a note of thanks to Prime Minister Narendra Modi for his constant encouragement. Union Minister Dr. Jitendra Singh, while addressing the gathering, said that India's space initiatives have been cost-effective, and the recent Operation Sindoor gave us an opportunity to test our rocket abilities. He affirmed that the Axiom 4 mission will benefit the country's space program. I think in a single mission, through a single mission, our astronauts have lived up to three or four flagship mantras which prime minister modi has been constantly practicing propagating over the last nearly 12 years ever since he's been at the helm moreover group captain prashant who's a part of the gaganyaan crew gave an interesting analogy stating the hindu epic ramayana calling himself lakshman to subhanshu's ram a few months from now we're going to be having diwali and that's the time when Sri Ram ji entered Ayodhya over here right now to the ram that is shooks if i can call myself lakshman it feels like this diwali here today when all our countrymen are here to receive us but remember even though i'm elder to shooks i would love to be lakshman to this ram any day that's how professional he is apart from giving references to ramayana Group captain Prashant explained the experience out there as Sat, Chit, and Anandam. In a detailed explanation, this is how he shaped things. Sat as Satya, that is the time of Bharat has come. Chit as Shiva, that we believe one is everyone and we share knowledge. Anandam as Sundaram, completing the Satyam Shivam Sundaram. He said everything is beautiful. Bharat believes in the oneness of humanity and the future is space and technology. Reiterating his heartfelt gratitude to the people of India, Group Captain Prashant reflected on the journey with humility and wisdom, saying the leaves will not blossom if the foundation is not strong. What has been our slogan since, you know, days immemorial in this country? Jai Jawan, Jai Kisan, but add to it Jai Vaigyanik now. And also why not Jai Har Bharatiya. You are the reason we are here. We get to wear the cool suits and look good in front of the camera concluding his address group captain shubhanshu shukla had a message for the children of the country here's what his message was all the kids who are listening to this message i i was sitting there with you i was sitting on the chairs that you are sitting on today and i had never thought i will reach here i would go to space but my message to you is if i can do this you can do this too and we have to make it work and we have to go forward from here one mission after another we'll have gaganyaan we'll have gaganyaan and thereafter bharti antrik station and we'll have a series of missions so i want you to dream i want you to think that you can do this and we will together make this happen group captain shubhanshu shukla etched his name in history as the first indian to journey to the international space station aboard axiom mission 4 after spending nearly 3 weeks in space he returned to earth on july 15th marking a proud moment for the nation